guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm showing you how to make text appear with smoke in Vegas Pro 14. So as you can see I have Vegas Pro 14 up and in my projects media is a green screen which I will be providing in the description. So once you download it um, you'll come across and you'll see right here there's that smoke and this is the smoke we're going to be using. So I'm going to split it to where the smoke is in the air and it goes off screen like so. So I'm going to press S on my keyboard and delete everything on the side. Now the first thing we need to do is get rid of the green screen itself. So to do that we're going to be heading over to video effects. If you don't see it then simply come to view, windows layout and select default layout. So from video effects you're going to come and select chroma here. I recommend dragging on the default onto the green screen. Then where it says color select it, select the color picker and then select the background. As you'll see it will remove the green. Now I recommend having these settings so the high threshold is all the way at a 1.000 and the low threshold is at 0. The next thing we're going to do is rotate the smoke. So to do this I'm going to be using track motion. So I'm going to select track motion. Now make sure sync cursor is not checked. What this means, it means we can be at the first keyframe right here on the track motion. However on our timeline we can come across and see how things will look. So I'm going to come across to this part right here where the smoke is at the peak and then I'm going to put the rotation on. I'm going to have snapping checked and I'm simply going to rotate it to the side like so. And of course with snapping you can see it makes things easier so it keeps it in the right angle we want it. Now I'm going to uncheck snapping and I'm going to make this bigger like so and I'm going to position this about here. So I'll play this through to see what it looks like. As you can see with this green screen there is an ending point to it. So with that being said that means we messed up on the track motion. So we head back over to the track motion and all we simply do is enlarge it a bit more like so and you'll see uh, once you uh, just line this up here that should now look a lot better than before. So playing it through from the beginning you'll see that is what it will look like and there's no harsh edge at the end so that makes it look better. So now we're actually going to be adding in the text. Now the way I recommend you do this so you play across and then use the arrows on your keyboard. So right here is where I want the text to wipe in. So the first thing I'm going to do is right click and insert another video track but we're going to make this below the green screen like so. So then we need to add our text. If you made text in Photoshop of course by all means you can add it in. However for people who don't have text and you want to use from Vegas then we're heading over to media generators. Again if you don't see it then simply come to view, windows layout and select default layout. Now from media generators I recommend you come in down to legacy text and then select one with a checkered background. The ones with a checkered background mean there's no background to it and the text is going to be visible with no background. So I'm going to use soft shadow. I'm going to drag and drop this right here onto that part we selected and now I'm just going to type in some text. So I've put in casual savage. I'm going to X out of it and if I play this through this is what we have so far. As you can see it does give the illusion that the text has appeared from the smoke. However if I play this frame by frame you will see if I get to where the text starts which is right there I believe, there we go. You can see that the C is already showing and as well as the A. Uh, although this may not be visible when you play it back, um, of course you want your edit to be clean. So to counter this part all we're going to do is head over to transitions. If you don't see transitions simply come to view, windows layout and select default layout. So from transitions head over to gradient wipe come down and you will see it says linear left to right. You're going to left click and drag this onto the text and this is going to wipe in the text. So I'm going to play this through and this is how it will now look. As you can see the text wiped in and I will play that for you uh, frame by frame now so you'll see if you watch carefully um, now the text is going to be wiping in. As you can see the C and the A, S everything is right there. And of course if you want to change the speed of the how fast this wiping in just left click this will make it quicker and of course this will make it longer. But that's how simple it is to do in Vegas Pro 14. I hope this tutorial has helped you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate and peace.